to day six at the Royal Melbourne Show. I'm Stephanie. And I'm Jade. Can't believe it's halfway through Australia, Victoria's largest annual community event. But from the looks of today's schedule, there's still heaps of fun stuff and animals for us to check out. We're going to head to the All Breeds Elite Dairy Show in the Livestock Pavilion. Also to the Herald Sun Arena to see Australia's finest jumpers and their states competing. We've got plenty to get through today, so let's go and do all the fun things at the show. Hey guys, we're in the Livestock Pavilion. Today we'll be checking out some of Victoria's finest cattle buy for the crown of the 2015 Supreme Exhibit. Uh, so thanks Taylor for joining us. Um, first of all, just tell us a little bit about what you guys do at the show. Um, well, we bring our cattle, um, dairy cattle, um, to the show and we um, get them ready and show them out in the ring and who gets the best prize and win ribbons like we just did before. And what was the prize? Um, we get a ribbon at minute um, and then you move on to another class junior champion where you'll get um, a red, white and blue ribbon if you win that and a trophy and there might be a cash prize or something like that. Yeah. And is this your first year at the show? No, I've been showing since I was a baby. <laughs> So I've done this a few years. <laughs> and what makes you keep coming back to the show? Um, just because I love it. I've just been doing it my whole life, so there's nothing really else I would do. <laughs> Thanks, Beth, for joining us. Um, so what's your role here at the show? I'm the general manager for agriculture, um, which means I'm responsible for all the agriculture programs here at the show. I'm also responsible for the food, wine and beverage through our Epicure program, so Royal Melbourne Fine Food Awards and Wine Awards. And I'm also responsible for the wood chop. But if it's specifically in this pavilion here, our big programs are our sheep and fleece programs, our beef carcass and beef programs, and as you can see, our dairy program. So we've got actually one of the best dairy judges in the world, Brian Cascadden from Canada here. Um, and he's highly regarded globally. But what he's looking for, he's looking for uh, the, the personal presentation of, of the people who are actually with the cattle. And so he'll look at how they hold themselves, how they dress and present themselves. And then he's actually looking for physical structure or what is called confirmation. So whether it's a horse, a sheep, a cow or beef, um, he's looking at the confirmation so what's really important about this show is our involvement of youth. So we have a very, very big program for beef carcass with schools. A lot of those kids are city kids, but they participate in these uh, school programs through sheep and beef, and you can see a lot of these young people here with dairy. It's obviously showing animals at a show, but from that comes uh, an interest in agriculture and hopefully an interest to pursue a career in agriculture. And we think that's very exciting, and industry think it's a really good public good. And it gives kids a great experience about coming to the show and and in front of lots of people presenting their animals. So, you know, that's one of the best things we do. So we're here at the Herald Sun Arena with Dave Cameron, who is the Australian show jumping champion for this year and last year. Nice to meet you, Dave. Tell us a little bit about the show jumping that is going on from today till Sunday. Okay, the show jumping starts here today and it goes through till Sunday. Um, the, in the senior section, there's three sections, part one, two, three. Part one being the toughest section, part three being the lowest. And there's also a junior section as well. You've had a few horses out there already? Yeah, we've had the part three competition, so I had my younger horses, and they, they jumped pretty good. They had one down, and one jump between the and one down the jump off, but, but they jumped pretty good. It's the first day of the show, so, um, you know, it's a good way to start. Tell us what kind of preparation goes into getting the horses and yourselves ready for when it comes to the Melbourne show? A lot for um, a royal show. Look, it's the biggest show you go to. Uh, so the quality out is really good. Some of the best riders in Australia, from Queensland, Victoria, New South yeah. Wales, South Australia are 10. So, um, you yeah, know, there's a lot of preparation. Um, there's several horses here that uh, are trying to get performances to maybe go to Rio Olympics next year. So, you know, very lucky that the public get to see such high quality show jumping. Great. Well, all the best and thank you for chatting with us, Dave. No worries. Nice to meet you. Thanks, guys, for watching. That's all we've got time for today. Head to royalshow.com.au to find out more. And don't forget to check out the Channel 31 YouTube channel. You can do all the things at the show.